gentlemen, welcome to my walkthrough of the Fangs Recruit Overhaul 6.0. You get more Hawaiian players, you get better names matching the skin tones, so you're not gonna have any like white cornerbacks named Deshaun, you know, crazy stuff like that. So you don't have to spend any money to get Excel or any of the Microsoft tomfoolery. All you need is this, I guess the hotfix right here, and you want to go to, I recommend you guys being in the college football revamped dynasty, not dynasty, the college football revamped discord. I <laughs> got my, my D words confused. And you need this NAE 106265 zip file because that is the AST coder. Um, so all you need right now, hopefully this will boot up real quick. Your dynasty needs to be in the preseason and there needs to be no recruits generated. So when I click this, it, it should say create prospects or skip to recruiting. Once you have that, you're going to want to exit out. Now, there's a couple of ways of doing this because I've had to record this so many times just to get it right and make it concise and easy for you guys. I already have it saved in my game files, but you want to find this file called USRDIR. It has the Q, QKL underscore boot. What you want is the QKL underscore FE2IG and the FKL underscore interface. So I'm going to copy these two because we're going to want to make basically copies of these. I actually done goofed. I needed my copies to be over here, which is where they will be. So make sure you have two copies here. We're gonna open up, I'll make this bigger so you guys can see. You want this NAE folder, NCAA. We're gonna do is we're gonna hit file, we're gonna hit open, and we need UKL underscore FE2IG. Make sure that is open. Wait for it to load up. Now, this is pretty important. You do not want to hit this pound or this hashtag thing. You just want to scroll all the way down to the very bottom to 4664. Hit extract. We're going to place it at our desktop, but we're going to move it to where I basically move the rest of the files in the games folder to where the actual ROM is located. And then we're gonna get, we're gonna hit file. We're gonna hit save as, and we're gonna tap it. We're not gonna actually save it. We're gonna hit this save this as test file or save it to whatever. But as long as you know that that's your test file, wait for that entire green bar to fill up. You see where it says save. We're gonna hit X. Scroll all the way back. Actually, I need my file. <laughs> Make sure can't forget that. Um, I'm going. I need this right here. So we're going to drag the file to where it's saved. This is the file 04664.db. We're going to bring this to the games file to where I saved our backups for the AST files. Um, now you're going to need to open up your Madden DB editor. And I have this saved in the Fangs 3.0 file, even though we are on 6.0 now. I still have it saved here to go to games here and you see where I saved that file 04664.db we're going to scroll down to 82 where it says RCAT RCAT right click we're going to hit import and we are going to the games folder this R06 underscore release, basically that file you had to download from the Discord, make sure it's extracted, obviously. Double click, double click. You see where it says RCAT? Boom. And it's gonna take a little bit, like it's gonna take at least like a solid 60 seconds of loading. So just wait for that to load. 
awesome. Now it is done loading and don't feel or don't get worried if it starts not responding the Madden Extreme DB editor. If it stops responding, honestly, just wait it out. It takes like a solid 50 Mississippis and you're good to go. We wanna hit save, exit out of this, exit out of that. Go all the way back. You wanna open up your NCAA AST editor. Open. We're gonna find our copied AST editor. Wait for that baby to load up. Scroll all the way down to 466. Right click, replace selected. We're gonna find that file 04664.db. And as you guys can see, it says this is where it's been saved. And then you're gonna hit file, save as, and you're gonna go to where the, you don't want the copies you just made. You want the original place as to where it is. Mine's under the, under the USR DIR. Um, this already exists, do you wanna replace it? We're gonna hit yes, override existing file, yes. And as you guys can see, it is saved up here. We can close this out and boom, we are good to go. Um, this next step is for people that want the new faces. If you don't want the new faces, I'll link in the video to where you can skip ahead. But for the people that do want the new faces, this is what you gotta do. Now those two files, the interface files and the, the FE2IG file, you're gonna make another copy. So this is copy number two. Make sure you hit control C. I'm gonna paste this here. I'm going to delete that test file because we're gonna make another test file anyway. We're gonna open up the AST editor. Let's go to games. Scroll all the way down to 4664 again. We're gonna extract again. I'm gonna save it to my desktop, but it's gonna go on the same place it's always been. The games folder to where everything else has been saved. Hit file, save as. I'm gonna call this my test. As you can see on the very top, it has been saved. We're gonna hit X. We're gonna go actually get my file 0664 file that's saved to my desktop. We're gonna replace it. We're gonna open up the Madden DB editor again. File open. Go to my games folder to where I saved the file that we just extracted. And now we're gonna go to row 72. This PGHE, we're gonna hit import. Um, I already have it already slightly open. We're gonna go to the R06 releases folder. At the very top, you're gonna to see a new faces. You're gonna hit that. And then you're gonna see this file 0664-pghe.csv. This is the one that you want. It's gonna boot up immediately. We're gonna hit file, we're gonna hit save. We're going back to our AST editor. We are going to the test.ast. Scroll all the way down, right click. We are going to replace the extracted 0664 file. File, save as. We're going to the original location, the USR DIR, and it needs to be under the FE2IG. Hit yes. Sorry, my background's changing, and every once in a while, my computer will lag just a bit. And as you guys can see at the very bottom, it will show. Actually, I'm, I'm mistaken. At the very top, you want to. It says saved here. Exit out of that. Now we 
are going to make yet another copy of the FE2IG file. Control C, we're gonna replace that one. Now we're gonna open up the AST editor one more time. Well, probably a couple more times. Um, instead of opening the FE2IG, we are going to open up the QKL underscore interface. We're gonna find row 137. Right click, we're gonna hit replace. We are gonna go to the, see if I can find it, new faces. Now you see this INT 137FE218 AST file? We're gonna click that. And as you guys can see, it has been imported correctly. So we're gonna file, we are going to save as, we're gonna save this where the original file is located. So we're going to USR, DIR, interface, hit yes, override existing file, yes. As you can see on the very top, it is saved. Now we're gonna go to file, open, we're gonna open a different file. We're gonna go scroll all the way down to where our copies are located. Should have deleted this. Awesome. Now we need to go to row 13. Don't need to extract. Press the wrong button there. Replace. New faces. The same INT137 file. We're going to replace that as well. And we're going to replace it with the original file. So you want to go to USRDIRFE2IG. Boom. So what you're going to want to do next is actually load up your Dynasty file and generate a recruiting class. All right. You want to boot up your Dynasty file. You did everything correctly. It's not going to freeze when you open it up. Hit set up recruiting board. Hit skip to recruiting. It's gonna do its thing real quick. I'm gonna go to all prospects just so we can look at them. So as you can see, there is a Caucasian middle linebacker named Rashid, which is, you know, it's, it's not realistic. So just, we're gonna hit circle. We're gonna back out completely. Even though it'll say at the bottom left, auto save in progress, what I usually do when it comes to stuff like this is actually manually save. So now that we have a manual save file created, we're gonna close out of this. We're gonna close out of this. As always, make sure you have a couple backups of your saves. You know, you anything can happen, you never know. So I'm gonna right click. I'm gonna go to where my save file is located. It's gonna say blue31159-dynasty-default2 because that is where my particular save file that I'm using for this, not only tutorial, but for my actual dynasty is located. So I'm gonna hit control C. We're gonna go all the way back to, you know, we'll go to where the RCAT's located. But if you go to where your R06 release folder is, double click that. If you go to new faces, well, yeah, you if you if you go to the R the PS3 because I'm doing PS3 dash emulator, so this is basically a PC tutorial. I've already done this before, so we're gonna replace this file. Yes, replace this file in the destination. As you can see, this was done at 8:07 p.m. And so if you used the R, if you if you skip the step to add the new portraits or the new faces, what you're gonna want to run is the RO.exe. But for tutorial purposes, we're using the R0 underscore new faces EXE because we're gonna have the new faces as well. So we're gonna double click this. It's gonna say file loaded successfully. This window will close when this tool is complete. So what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna wait. It should take like 60 Mississippis. Like if you count out 60 Mississippis, you'll be good to go. But the program will automatically close once it's done doing its thing. So now we wait. Awesome. As you guys can see, it automatically closed by itself. So you want to go to your save file. As you can see, it's 8.10 p.m. here. It's been modified at 8.10 p.m. We're going to click Control-C. 
we're gonna go to where our save file is located. I just had it. There we go. Sorry, I have too many, <laughs> too many things open. We're gonna replace to where our, our original save file is located. You want that replaced? As you can see, it's been replaced at 8:10 p.m. It's actually at 11, but you know, it's always a current save file. We're gonna open up NCAA one more time, ladies and gentlemen. Boot up your dynasty. Obviously, if it hasn't froze by now, you've done something right. We're gonna go to all prospects here. And as you can see, his name is no longer Rashid, it's Victor. And you can see all the players that wanna visit my school. You will definitely see a lot less Caucasian DBs, if there's any, I don't, I don't see any yet. And the faces look a lot better, too. Oh, well, if you're seeing what I see, you've done something right. Um, obviously, big shout out to Fang. He is the mastermind behind all of this stuff. And thank you for everyone in the Discord that helped me out this morning as I was asking questions in preparation of making this video. If you have any other questions, I would definitely recommend hitting up that Discord first because there's a lot more intelligent people in that Discord. And if they don't answer, then you can always hit me up. Um, have a blessed evening and thank you for watching. Peace.